Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I am going to be doing another unboxing. So I know how much you guys love them um, and I just want to pop out a little disclaimer. I am not bragging at all on what I'm unboxing. I just love watching these types of videos on YouTube and that's why I thought I would make some for my own. Um, and I think it's quite nice to share because seeing images of things online sometimes doesn't make up for it so if you maybe see someone actually unboxing it then it maybe looks a little bit different and it looks more real on how it would be if you actually had the item so yeah i hope you guys do enjoy this video if you like these types of videos i have a full playlist that i'll leave it down in the description box down below for you all and also don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss any of my other videos or even any other unboxings but i hope you guys enjoy and let's just get on to today's video Okay, so as you'll be able to see by the title, I am unboxing Michael Kors shoes. So I did pay for the gift wrap. The gift wrap is £3.50. Michael Kors, as I've spoken about in my other two Michael Kors unboxings, they don't actually do, or three. Yeah, I've done, no, four. I've done four Michael Kors unboxings, oh my goodness. Um, so yeah, they don't actually give you complimentary gift wrap, which is really annoying, but I suppose it's a cheaper, high end brands if you will um but it's still obviously really expensive okay so these trainers had cost 170 pounds and they are called the georgie mixed media trainer and the reason i decided to get these ones rather than any of the other ones is because i just thought they looked a little bit different it looked a little bit like not something that i would normally have and when you're spending like a lot of money i would rather have something that like i maybe couldn't normally get as a, a cheaper branded trainer so obviously as i said it came in this um gift box and if i just take a little bow off it what i really like is the bow just kind of goes back on it's really easy um i'm still trying to work out how to wrap my louis vuitton one which is so annoying because i literally can't wrap it for the life of me and then i've just got obviously tissue paper and stuff and then it comes in the shoe box so the shoe box is just it's not as um good quality as like the alexander mcqueen one or even as good quality as a gift box but i suppose it's a shoe box what do you expect um and then when i open it up oh, on tissue paper it comes with a little card on how to care for them these have got glitter on them so obviously um I really do need to be careful and this is them here so i have tried it on um just before um just so i know if they fit or not and this is the shoe here so i think they're absolutely stunning they're like not something that i've already got which i really really like they're just black in the inside and the bit that says michael kors is kind of like a um vinyl material and what i like about these as well is obviously they're white and they've got a little bit black in there so they'll go with anything and then they've got the little bit of red which they do have obviously a lot of red but they've got more white than red so they will go with a lot more um so they've got like on this side this is the right foot so here it's got michael kors um like just the name there and this is kind of like a snake tint red and black and then you've got your red gold there and then at the back you've got your Michael Kors again your did I say gold I meant glitter and um, you've got your glitter and then again you've got your um, snake print there with your little hooky bit that's got a little bit of cardboard in it which is really nice um, and then on the other side it's got again that and then just the same kind of print it kind of like mirrors itself apart from the inside obviously doesn't have the michael cars so the toe is all leather um all the way around to about here and then this it's not mesh but it's more meshy you'll probably be able to see and then this is more spongy so it's not all the same all the way around um i don't think it's came with extra laces or anything so obviously i've always been a little bit careful with the laces especially with them being white the tongue is black and it's got 
a Michael Kors with the snake print again and the laces are obviously white and then they've got a little silver detailing there which is really really nice um, as well. I think I'm definitely going to need to make sure I keep the tissue paper in these because that was one thing that I don't do with my Alexander McQueen's and I feel like they hold up well but I think because your feet sit like that, these are quite high toppy but they're not high tops um, but your feet are sitting like that so you're like going down because you'll be able to see at the bottom that it's quite narrow and like someone's foot wouldn't sit comfortably in there um, but you don't actually stand on this, it's this area like if this was obviously see through and um, you'll be able to see that you actually stand in this area so the curve that's there is actually how it is now i haven't obviously worn these properly i just tried them on to make sure they fit and that they were comfy enough for me um because i had never bought a pair of michael kors trainers before and if you do know alexander mcqueen's um, you need to size down because they're oversized i didn't see anything in the description with these but i just didn't want to like leave it and then not be able to send them back so i'll just get the other shoe out obviously the two shoes are the same but i've not actually um looked at this one properly i just tried the other one on so i will need to try the two on um, but i did really like the comfort on that other one so yeah um just the same i got mine in a size six because i am a six um and they fit really really nice they fit really comfy um but definitely head over to my instagram and follow me on there because i will be updating you guys on comfort and stuff of these trainers which i absolutely love them so much i love they're not something that i've got so yeah i absolutely love them so 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 much and i really really can't wait to get out and to wear them and get so much use out of them because they just the quality of them just feels amazing and yeah the tongue is nice and thick and spongy at the bottom and I don't think they'll be too bad to break in either. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. Don't forget to smash a big thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.